In this video, I wanna share with you guys a way that I super clean floor mats um, without necessarily having any expensive equipment. So what's going on and welcome back to the Wilson Auto Detailing community. Thank you guys so much for being here. I'm very, very grateful that you're even taking the time to watch this video. So right here guys, I'm at a customer uh, customer's house and uh, I wanted to do a little voiceover video for this, at least for part of this video, just so I can explain in detail kind of what I'm doing. And basically this vehicle, um, and of course you can see what I'm doing right now, but this vehicle has never been maintained by me, it's never been cleaned by me, and uh, it was in pretty bad shape. And the floor mats, of course, are an area of every car that's in bad shape. It's an area of those cars that are going to require a specific amount of attention and um, probably a lot more intense uh, cleaning. So what I'm doing here is going all out, okay? I'm not using a steamer, I'm not using an extractor, but uh, as I finish this first floor mat, I wanna walk you through uh, kind of what I do after this. Now, obviously I'm using a pressure washer. Yes, you can see I'm wetting the, the mat before I do anything, just spraying a little water on it. This is a new uh, all-purpose cleaner that I'm testing out from a company called Auto Magic. They've been around a very long time. Um, it's just me experimenting like I always do uh, in my auto detailing world, but you guys can see I'm soaking this mat in cleaner. It's not going to be an issue that I'm soaking it. I want to soak it. I soak it in the cleaner, I take my pressure washer, I spread the cleaner around a little bit more, and then I take my drill brush. Now these drill brushes, I'm gonna hook them up in the, in the YouTube description box below. I'm actually coming out with my own Wilson auto detailing drill brushes that should be ready to be to buy um, in the next month or two months, and this is, I'm using my specific drill brush from Wilson Auto Detailing, um, but I'm gonna hook up some other options for you below. This is a very, very uh, intense, like, what would I say intense, um, hard, a stiff drill brush that I was using here. You can see now that I'm rinsing, obviously, the mat out. This method of cleaning, uh, number one, yes, more or less, it's going to require a pressure washer because it does require an intense kind of, uh, what would I say, intense amount of pressure to be able to push all this cleaner out of the mat. You guys can see I'm doing it in a pretty systematic way pushing that cleaner out of the mat. And this is one of the best ways to super clean floor mats because it really is going to get rid of, I mean, 90% of staining, okay? So now I'm doing a little final rinse here. And again, that drill brush, the reason I use that is because it's just such an effective way to clean. It makes the cleaner so much more effective. All I'm doing here is brushing out with a regular brush from like Walmart, brushing out the excess water, making sure all the fibers are going one way. And then I'm going to sit it in the sun and I'm not even going to extract it because it's going to dry in a matter of an hour or two and be no problem. So literally, all I'm using, pressure washer, my cleaner, and a drill brush. And uh, that is very literally it, I don't even have to extract the water because all the cleaner is pushed out. So the only thing that's left to dry is the water. The sun is going to do that for me. It's going to be very easy and I can move on with my life. So you guys can go ahead and watch the rest of this video, but I wanted to do a little quick explanation of what I was doing here. 